Once you've started your fertility treatment, you'll be hoping for a day five transfer. As you probably know, embryos that grow to day five are called blastocysts. It's a rather strange name, but the thing to focus on is that a blastocyst is the best kind of embryo you can get. Why is that? Well, if they grow for longer in the lab, they've got more staying power. Your clinic can have a really good look at them under the microscope. Patients often ask me, why not always put in blastocysts? The answer is, you may not get there. Depending on your age and the number and quality of your eggs, your clinic may feel it's safer to transfer a younger embryo. Do blastocysts lead to more babies? Yes, they do, quite often. If you're under 35, live birth rates after a blastocyst transfer are higher. I had a quick look at the stats from clinics in Europe, and blastocyst transfers are definitely on the rise. Which brings me to the million dollar question. Should you transfer one or two? This really depends on your embryos and your attitude to risk. Transferring two increases the risk of complications and a multiple birth, and that's certainly true if you transfer blastocysts. But some women put in two to increase their chances. Final tip, if you've got two good quality blastocysts, it may be tactical to transfer one and freeze the other. For more tips and information, please see our website.